Brian Joseph Leach born March 3, 1968, is an American former professional ice hockey defenseman who played 18 National Hockey League NHL, seasons with the New York Rangers, Toronto Maple Leafs, and Boston Bruins. Brian Leach's storied hockey career began with a standout season at Boston College, which led to his selection for the U.S. Olympic team at the 1988 Calgary Games. Just eight days after the Olympics, he made his NHL debut with the New York Rangers on February 29, 1988, and recorded his first NHL point with an assist. He concluded the 1987-88 season with 14 points in 17 games. In his first full NHL season, 1988-89, Leach scored 71 points, including a record 23 goals for a rookie defenseman, earning the Calder Memorial Trophy and a spot on the NHL All-Rookie Team. As the Rangers developed into a top-tier team, Leach gained admiration for his quiet demeanor and offensive skills. In 1992, he became the fifth defenseman and the only American to score 100 points in a season, winning the Norris Trophy. He held the record as the last NHL defenseman to reach 100 points until Eric Carlson in the 2022-23 season. Leach's career faced a setback on March 21, 1993, when he broke his ankle after slipping on black ice, causing him to miss the remainder of the season and contributing to the Rangers missing the playoffs. However, he rebounded in 1994, matching his career high of 23 goals and helping the Rangers win the President's Trophy. That year, the Rangers ended their 54-year championship drought by defeating the Vancouver Canucks in the Stanley Cup Finals, with Leach becoming the first non-Canadian to win the Conn Smythe Trophy. He was the second player in NHL history, after Bobby Orr, to win the Calder Trophy, Norris Trophy, and Conn Smythe Trophy, a feat only matched by Kale McCarr since. Leach remained a key player and fan favorite for the Rangers, serving as captain from 1997 to 2000. In 1996, he captained the victorious American team at the inaugural World Cup of Hockey. He won his second Norris Trophy in 1997 and led the Rangers to the Eastern Conference Finals, though they were defeated by the Philadelphia Flyers. The following years saw the Rangers struggle, missing the playoffs each season. In 1998, Leach was ranked 71st on the hockey news list of the 100 greatest hockey players. In 2003, his rights were traded to the Edmonton Oilers, but he returned to the Rangers shortly after as a free agent. In 2004, the Rangers traded Leach to the Toronto Maple Leafs for several prospects and draft picks. He was set to play for the Maple Leafs in the 2004-2005 season, but the NHL lockout led to the expiration of his contract, making him a free agent. Leach then signed a one-year deal with the Boston Bruins for the 2005-2006 season, during which he scored his 1,000th career point. Despite receiving offers during the 2006-2007 season, Leach chose not to return to the NHL and officially retired on May 24, 2007. The New York Rangers retired his number two jersey on January 24, 2008, and he was inducted into the United States Hockey Hall of Fame later that year. In 2009, Leach was inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame, joining teammates from the Rangers' 1994 Stanley Cup team. In August 2015, Leach became the manager of player safety in the NHL's Department of Player Safety, a role he held for one season. His legacy as one of the greatest defensemen in NHL history remains firmly intact. Besides that, Leach was born in Corpus Christi, Texas, but grew up in Cheshire, Connecticut, after his family moved there when he was three months old. He learned to play hockey at a local rink managed by his father, Jack. In high school, he excelled in both baseball and hockey, initially at Cheshire High School and later at Avon Old Farms. However, hockey was where he truly shined. As a sophomore at Cheshire, he scored 53 goals and 50 assists, earning All-State honors. Over two seasons at Avon Old Farms, Leach recorded 70 goals and 90 assists in 54 games, impressive statistics for a defenseman. NHL scouts took notice, and the New York Rangers selected him as their first-round pick, ninth overall, in 1986, making him the first player drafted that year who did not play major junior hockey. Following his father Jack's path, Brian enrolled at Boston College in the fall of 1986 and, like his father, became an All-America defenseman for the Eagles. In depth, Leach married Mary Beth O'Neill in 1999. The couple has three children, two sons, Jack and Sean, and a daughter, Riley. Throughout his life, 
Leach has remained deeply connected to the hockey community, both through his professional achievements and his personal dedication to the sport. After retiring from professional hockey in 2007, Leach has been involved in various charitable activities and hockey-related endeavors. He remains a celebrated figure in the hockey world, particularly for his significant contributions to the New York Rangers and his status as one of the greatest defensemen in NHL history. Leach was inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame in 2009, cementing his legacy in the sport. In conclusion, Brian Leach has an estimated net worth of $37 million. He built up this significant wealth by virtue of his extended career in hockey, highly profitable endorsement contracts, and involvement in various business ventures. In addition to that, Brian Leach has been called one of the top defensemen in NHL history. Leach accumulated many individual honors during his 18-year career. He was a two-time Norris Trophy winner as the NHL's best defenseman, 1992, 1997, and was the first American-born winner of the Conn Smythe Trophy as playoff MVP for his performance during the Rangers' run to the 1994 Stanley Cup Championship. Leach is one of only six NHL defensemen to score 100 points in a season with his 102-point campaign in 1991-92. He won the Calder Trophy as the NHL Rookie of the Year in 1989, and his 23 goals that season remain an NHL record for rookie defensemen. Leach's number two was retired by the Rangers on January 24, 2008. During the ceremony, longtime teammate Mark Messier referred to Leach as the single greatest Ranger of all time. Leach was inducted into the Hockey Hall of Fame in Toronto in 2009, his first year of eligibility. In 2017, Leach was named one of the 100 greatest NHL players in history. He was inducted into the IHF Hall of Fame in 2023. And with that, thanks for watching. Give us a like, share with your friends, and please subscribe.